All right, you too. This is my grandpa. He just passed away. Age 90. I'm going to watch the live stream pretty soon. I don't have the ability to go all the way to Utah, so I'll read it as I go along. Lynn Thomas was born May 25th, 1990 in Genola, Utah. He passed away September 16th, 2020 in Vernal, Utah. Lynn was the number was number eight of eleven children who grew up on a farm where he learned to work hard and he loved working outdoors all of his life. After graduating from high school, Dad served a two year mission to Norway for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter day Saints. He returned home and left again to serve in career conflict. 1953 to 1955 after being honorably discharged from the army he met colleen mordu and they married january 4 1956 in payson utah they were later sealed together for eternity in the salt lake uh, temple their marriage was blessed with four children, 14 grandchildren, and 23 uh, great grandchildren. Or, yeah, great grandchildren. Lynn graduated from BYU with degrees in chemistry and education. Uh, yeah, he was known for his invention in the oil business. Uh, yeah, he's the reason why our oil. Uh, is so good right now he taught math chemistry and other sciences for the you e a school district i'm pretty sure he um helped out with the refining of the oil so that way it could burn more efficiently and produce more energy per uh whatever it is anyways uh let's see yeah, chemistry and other sciences for Uwena School District, retiring in 19... Uh, he taught math, chemistry, and other sciences for the Uwena School District, retiring in 1977. After retiring from the school district, he worked for uh, Champion Chemical and Chevron as a chemist, uh, finally retiring... For real from Chevron in 1998. Dad always had a smile on his face and found joy in almost everything. He especially loved his uh, grandchildren and then his... And then his grandchildren, great-grandchildren. He loved telling us stories. Yeah, he always had stories to tell. He loved telling us stories about growing up on the farm and how he spent his younger days. He found joy in um, serving in his church and always and was always able to find a scripture for everything. One of his favorite things to do was to remind us that the worth of a soul is greater than anything else on earth. Lynn it is survived by his wife Colleen, children Thomas Lee, uh, Thomas, uh, Tamala, Justin, Connor, which is my mom's Tamala and my dad's Justin, Connor, uh, Terry Lynn Dockery, um, he, Tamala, my mom, that's his daughter, uh, Tamala Connor, uh, Terry Lynn Dockery, Gary, Dockery, Troy, uh, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your name, I feel so bad, <laughs> Shaylin, <laughs> Thomas, I guess, his brother Douglas, Thomas, his sister Peggy Hunt, uh, 14 grandchildren and 23 great-grandchildren. He w was preceded in death by his parents, uh, five brothers and three sisters, and daughter-in-law, Wendy Wardle uh, Thomas. 
Services will be held Wednesday, September 23rd, 2020 at 11 a.m. at Ashley Valley Funeral Home, which would be one my time. Uh, yeah, so it'll be coming up pretty soon. Um, yeah. At Ashley Valley Funeral Home, 410 North 800 West, Vernal. A uh, viewing for the family and friends will be held at Ashley Valley, Valley Funeral Home. But, um, yeah, I wasn't able to travel. But and it's not like even if I was able to travel, I would actually go to the funeral because all the corona and stuff like that. I just don't feel like traveling right now. So I'm going to actually watch the live stream. I'm not actually going to film it. But, yeah. Anyways, September 22nd. 6 through 8 p.m. and September 23rd from 9.45 to 10.45 a.m. Uh, inter intermittent will be in the Rock Point Cemetery. Uh, how can you measure a man's life in five short paragraphs? You will be missed. Uh, yeah. And loving memory of Thomas Lynn. I don't know what happens if I press this. Let's see. Say how long this is. That's his wife.
does my mom. So tired. I'm gonna have to drink an energy drink to stay awake for the funeral. Ugh. Started at nine and got off at like ten thirty. But he's my grandpa, so I got gotta see his funeral. I liked my grandpa a lot too. stop this and bring it right back. <laughs> 